With the number one seed in the NFC wrapped up, there's little to play for from the Saints when they host the Panthers in Week 17. Carolina is going with third stringer Kyle Allen under center. So Steve, how do the stats size up this NFC South showdown? Yeah, like you said, Kyle Allen quarterback. Honestly, I'm not sure that changes very much. I think we just see a lot of short stuff and a lot of giving it to Christian McCaffrey. That was effective against Atlanta. They didn't score a lot of points. They had a lot of turnovers in the red zone, but they did have 450 yards. And I think we'll see a similar game plan against the Saints. I'm not sure how well it's going to work. New Orleans, great run defense, allowing only 3.25 yards per carry to running backs. At the same time, though, middle of the pack against receiving run backs. So I, I do expect Christian McCaffrey to still have a good day. You look at schedule adjusted EPA, I have the Saints about seven points per game better. So plus home field, something around nine or 10 seems right. I think the big story is, you know, whether Sean Payton plays his starters in this game. Yeah, it sounds like he is going to, and that's the way the betting market's treating it right now. So New Orleans minus seven and a half. Payton came out, said he's going to play guys. So it jumped up to minus eight and a half here. Uh, Carolina has just been bad on the road all season. One in six straight up and ATS. Now they get a third stringer under center. Like you mentioned, this offense is kind of designed, you know, and, and with, even with Cam in there, they weren't really yeah. putting up a lot Making of points. Easy on the quarterback. Yeah, they're averaging just 14 points over their last four games. The total for this one, 44 and a half. <laughs>